If you're trying, if you're trying to buy cash flow rentals in Palm Beach, Florida, you may find yourself dealing with a housing market that it feels like it's a crisis for us landlords, dude. Everything is so expensive these days. What do we do? What do people like you do? They hook up with people like me because I help investors like you. Open your horizons to the entire USA and I find you the best cash flow markets, the best bang for your buck. And I'm doing that for a couple from Palm Beach today. Let's go. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Welcome to the show, folks. Sandy and Chris, husband wife duo, helping you guys help your daughter, right? You guys got a great story. You guys are trying to invest in real estate so you can create a trust for your daughter uh, to, to support herself, right? She's got special needs, right? And that's what's so great about real estate investing. It allows us to do things to give back to our family, give back to our community, do what we want to do, right? And folks, I got another solid investment for you. Fully renovated in a nice market. I see a lot of good things happening in this market. I see a bunch of new jobs coming and the property itself is only going to cost you about 20K out of your pocket. Let's check it out. Man, I hate those other real estate gurus out there. Those real estate gurus that lead you guys to believe fairy tales, lead you guys to believe in magic, lead you guys to think that there's going to be genies granting your wishes if you buy their course or their program. Like there's going to be hot girls in bikinis just popping out. That's not the real life of a real estate investor. And here on Holton Wise TV, we give it to you straight. Welcome back, folks. Let's pull up this turnkey house. Now, this house located in Northeast Ohio, y'all. 1015 West 22nd Lorraine, Ohio, 44052. Just dropped it down to 99. They were trying to get well over 100, a couple price drops. Now we're starting to get into the range where it makes sense for investors. Now, I bet most of you out there have never heard of Lorraine, Ohio. You're like, Lorraine, Ohio? The heck is that? I never heard of no Lorraine, Ohio. That's good. That's good. When people Google best cash flow markets in the USA, they usually come across Cleveland. Same market, folks. It's like 30 minutes west. But my opinion, better place to invest right now. Number one, the city of Cleveland itself Small piece of the puzzle in the greater grand scheme of things in the Cleveland market. Where Holton Wise Services, where we do full service property management, maintenance, construction, insurance, where we help investors buy, we have a population of like four to five million people. The city of Cleveland itself, which gets all the national press, only has about 340,000 people, okay? So it's a very small piece of the puzzle. And that city is going through some issues right now. They just enacted brand new lead paint certification laws okay it's a very confusing convoluted process and the city is just getting it rolling does this change how you invest oh you bet you it does i did a half hour video on that topic i'm going to link it below okay does that mean cleveland as a city is a bad investment no but right now there's a lot of things you need to know about and there's a lot of turmoil so i'm taking a wait and see approach and i'm advising a lot of my clients to do the same Reasons all explained why in that video below, right? So we have an easier to deal with government in Lorraine, which is about half hour west of Cleveland. In addition, we have better pricing because it doesn't get all the press that the city of Cleveland does. Nobody's heard of it, right? There's no Lorraine Cavs, no Lorraine Browns, no Lorraine Indians, or Lorraine Guardians if you're woke. And you can pick up properties like this little guy, man. Look at this thing. Totally renovated to the nines, man. This is perfect blue-collar living, dude. It's fresh. It's clean. It's crisp. And it is friggin' cheap, dude. Your tenants are going to love this thing, right? Fresh, clean, safe housing, man. That's what they want. They even get a little hangout area in the basement, right? That's rare in these neighborhoods, right? Big ticket item right here. Brand new furnace, man. These things cost about three Gs, last about 30 years. You ain't got to worry about it, okay? They're asking 99 I am going to want to have you bid 90. Then what we're going to do, get a Section 8 or cash-paying tenant, about 11 and a quarter. Yeah, 11 and a quarter 
for this teeny tiny little house that's going to cost you like 20-something G's out of your pocket, right? 11 and a quarter. Factor in your fixed and variable expense estimates with my team handling the management. You're looking at approximately 7371 in a pure NOI. That's factoring in capital expenditures. But all the stuff on this is new, right? New furnace, new hot water tank. The roof is new-ish, right? So we're looking good, right? So a lot of that is money you're probably going to be getting on top of this for a very long time. But no, eventually you need to replace these, right? Like eventually you'll need to do that furnace again, right? But pure cash flow estimates, about 7300 a year on average. Now, if you could pick it up at 90, you only put down 22 and a half. Bank kicks in the other 67 and a half. That projects out to an 18% cash on cash return. In addition, Lorraine, two new naval bases being built right over there. That's going to add several thousand jobs. You know what happens to housing demand when you add several thousand jobs? Boop! Yeah, it goes up, folks. Safe, solid, C ish grade neighborhood. Have your pick of Section 8 or regular pay tenants. We manage a ton of properties over there. And in my opinion, this is the emerging market in the Cleveland market right now. Definitely smart to take a wait-and-see approach due to those lead laws in the city of Cleveland. Lorraine government so much easier to deal with. So much more landlord-friendly at the moment. No turmoil, right? This deal, this is a solid investment. Let me know what you want to do. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.